Hey you people, I am 30 and welcome back to Return of Caesar here in Xeri Kings 3. Playing as Gaius Julius Caesar himself. This is probably the first time I have actually recorded back to back episodes in the same time. Like in a long time. But I have to. Because I'm going to start working again. Working nights starting the day when you see the episode before this one. And I'm also going to be working the day you see this episode, so I'm try having to pre-record a bit, so I can give you something to watch, that's why I'm doing that. I want to create this statue actually. I was thinking about it when I saw this, I'm going to give it to you. You're going to become the Duke of Mallorca. And that actually solved that issue, it's not going to be solved for long though, because I'm very soon going to get some new vassals because I'm gonna try and keep on conquering mainly here in Gaul but also in Iberia and I probably should try and take some things in Morocco but I think that's that's not my priority right now I'm gonna go for Iberia first then Africa <coughs> pardon me we are entirely down in the in the east though the Middle East so that makes me happy yes it does I think I might need some things from Bavaria as well I only need... That's such a mess. He's not particularly strong. He lost that war against my vassal. He is not strong at all. He has some allies which are strong. I'm gonna go for trans and Hopefully one of my vassals will try and take this thing for me. Because that's only... Um, that's only one county. I'm only one. I want this duchy. I'm gonna take this one. I'm gonna siege from this from this side and I'm gonna try and take as much as possible. Seeing as the Romans in real life actually had more only 1% chance of dying and I didn't get wounded. Do I have that high like? Uh, it's actually kinda okay, my promise. That, that's nice. I'm feeling good. That makes me feel happy that I'm feeling good. Yeah, I kill this child. I, seeing as the Romans in real life had more of Germany than we have to take to get the... Well... What's it called? I think it's called... Whoa! I'm really struggling with the names of things today. He is not dead. Kill him again. Man, I, I, I'm, just, I'm just blanking on the things today. If you want to restore the entirety of the Roman borders, we don't have to take the entirety of Germany like the Romans had in real life. But seeing as I pro basically want to go for Trajan's borders, that means I gotta try and have to take some more things from the Germans. I probably need Dacia as well if I want to go for Trajan's borders. Because they did own Dacia under Trajan. So I, wanna, I probably want to go for that one as well. So we're gonna have to kill like the these people. I guess. It does make sense. It really does. Someone is trying to kill my son or something. I would prefer if you didn't. If you don't mind. She's not currently preggers. Can you please make me a good grandson? Because I don't really like this one. He's trash. And I would like not to have to play as one of your daughters. I think they're good though. But I haven't cared about their education. So no one is doing their education. So they're going to be terrible. They're going to be really, really bad, both of them, because I haven't cared about their education. So <laughs> I would prefer not to have to play as any of those two, if I could choose. Man, I'm really blanking on things. What's it called? When... Man. The Roman peas that they had for some centuries in the first, in the first century AD, basically. It's a, it's a Latin word, a phrase. Oof. Yeah, it, I'm really, I'm, I really am struggling. Today. It doesn't feel particularly good, <laughs> to be fair. Man. That's my daughter you gained, this, gave me a grandson. It's actually really good. I like him. And someone has been sending, so I, I think that's fine though. I don't, I don't care. People can say however much they want to, as long as it's not my wife. I don't actually particularly care. By the way, where is the Bavarian army? I don't, 
I don't know. I don't... Oh, <laughs> there it is. Interesting. How is your supply? It's actually good. How are you supplied? It's good. We do have some peasants being pissed off, so I guess I have to, well, deal with them. And there seems to be a lot of them. Yeah, there is a lot of peasants going around. So I guess I need to do something about them. Especially these 9k of them, which is currently in Roma. I would prefer if you didn't siege my capital down, you know? It's not particularly nice of you. It's a very beautiful city, the Eternal City, and I would prefer if you left it standing as it is. Please. Oh, the High Priest is dead. Who's the new one? Who is the new High Priest of my fate? It's my brother who for some reason hates me. Because he's actually my rival. And I do have this offensive war thing. So my head of fate. Pardon me, I was trying to adjust my seat. Our head of fate hates my guts. Why could I imprison him? What has he done? He attempted to murder a family member. Interesting. Interesting indeed. I do need some more levy if I want to kill these people because I don't want to go in blind and try and kill them. So I'm going to go for you. That should be fine. Low control because that thing happened. Some granddaughters could get married. That seems fine. Yeah, marry my grandson. Or we'll marry this guy first. Uh, is he the guy? No, he, he's that other guy. You are... Not my fire. You are going to marry someone. Probably a good one, if I could find one. Vizena Se Libwik. Pomeranian. That seems amazing. Have fun. While I go and ransom some people for cash. Because I'm lacking in cash right now. And I'm actually losing money because I have so many people raised at the same time. And my rival is dead. Good. And you teach down the Bavarian capital if you would like to, please. They do apparently have some allies in England, which I find peculiar, but that's apparently the case right now. That was easy. He is decent. I'm going to actually recruit you. And I'm going to leave these guys until I have sieged down their capital so I can disband everyone in one go without it being a problem for us. Oh, I actually captured his son as well. Made things easier and disband everyone and please give me my income back. And I'm going to grant this too. First, I'm going to create the duchy. We're going to usurp the duchy. And I'm going to grant it to who? That's a good question. What I'm going to do, I'm going to actually give away Meloon because I don't want this. I'm going to give away to Belisarius, and then I'm going to grant all of these three things to one person. A really big duke. You are gaining the entire Duchy of Transurania. Be happy about it. Please. And we are above the vassal limit again. A grand right is fine though. I like that. So we only need one more county from Bavaria, then we have the entirety that we need here. It's Crane. Ljubljana. 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 I'm not good at Croatian. Oh, they're basically all speaking an alteration of Serbian, but they speak basically the same language. But I, I'm not good at it. My girlfriend is... My girlfriend is Albanian, not Croatian. I can't speak Croatian. Or the Croatian language. Whichever that is. It's difficult. Grand right the more the merrier. Please join. I am happy for it. I'm gonna go for the one that's most possible, which is this one. And I am gaining one learning perk for free. I paid 50 gold for it, but I gained it for free. Yes, I did. Piety is not bad. How much piety do I have, by the way? I think I already have enough if I wanna... Oh, maybe not. I probably want that perk if I want to create a new religion. 
I'm only 52 years old and I'm feeling good. I think it's going to be okay. I am not fecund though, so that's bad. But I think I do have in my family bloodline something that makes us live longer. Yeah, this one. Octogr Octogenarians making us live five years longer. So if I had fecund as well, that would make me live bloody forever. As well as being a Herculean. I wish I were a Herculean. Yes, I really was. Really wish that I was Herculean. I could attack this guy again. I would like to go to be able to go for a kingdom. But that's not possible right now. Now he's calling himself Hispania instead of man. And that actually makes me a bit happy. Because I feel like calling himself the Empire of Man is a bit cocky. No. I'm gonna go for Armad. No, this one. Bordeaux. Used to make things look a bit prettier. And I'm gonna make it easy for myself by sitting down this cap. Can I, can I cross him? Yeah, I can. If I go here instead. Until next time, then I'm gonna go for Grand Right again. I gotta work out. Why not? Try and keep my stress low. See here. That seems fine. I can still pay my keep about. Man. Oh. Wait, what? Is he the guy that I'm trying to kill? Where are you? Oh, you became a king instead. Oh, interesting. So you're a king beneath this guy now. Then I guess I don't need to kill you. I already paid for killing this guy though, so I'm not gonna change it. I'm gonna keep on killing him. He's just a young child, he has not done nothing against me, but I'm still gonna murder him. Oh, thank you for promoting the culture. I'm gonna keep on doing that somewhere else. That's the Anatolian king. This is the king of Pontus, he's also Greek. So I think I'm gonna go for his capital as well. Trying to make him Roman, preferably. He might, he has the option to, of course, to adapt to the culture of the place that he lives in. And I wish that that's it's something that he's gonna do. I really feel like my son is not really popping out the babies. She's pregnant again, though. So we might get a new son, a new grandson. And hopefully that's a good one. Defenseless, he's dead. And apparently I feel guilty about killing a child. I don't really know why. I'm callous, I shouldn't care about it. We kill children all the time. Is there anything I can change about you? No, because you're barren. So that's a bit weird. They're trying to sit me down. I am sitting them down quicker than they sit me down. So I feel like it's uh, it's easy. I'm going for this one. It gives me the most learning. This is my patient. And this guy was bleeding out. And someone was plotting against my son. And I actually figured that out. Very close to profit. So we're going to try and reform the fate. A new one. I think it makes sense because we have this head of fate guy, which I don't particularly enjoy. What should I call the fate then? Should I call it like the Hellenic fate? Hellenic 2? Hellenic 1? Roman fate? The Caesar Risen? Sul Invictus? I guess Sul Invictus would make sense. That was actually a real fate. It was a cult, the cult of Sul Invictus. It was a very famous one, a very popular one, that they had back in the Roman era. I think that we could call it that. Write me some comments down below about what you want to call this new fate that we're going to do. We're going to reform the fate, which means we have to do make a new one. And what do you want me to call that fate? It's entirely up to you. Write me a good comment and write me a comment and also give me a good explanation why I should call it that. And that's going to probably be the one I go for. Because it's not really that many people who generally comment. So I don't think it's going to be that much competition for you. I'm going to give this to Aurelius. I'm going to grant this to Anicius Heracles. And then I'm going to grant every single thing to the same person. Together with the Duchy, Galenius. 
the Duchy of Gasgog. Gasgog. Makes me think about the guy in Beauty and the Beast. You know, isn't the is it is it they call like something like Gaston is his name. Gaston. Gaskog and Gaston. Almost the same thing. Almost the same thing. Obviously not the same thing, but almost the same thing. Apparently one of my sisters killed another one of my sisters. Very nasty of them. I think this is a part of the reason why my income is so low. This one is not done yet. I'm trying to build this. It's going to take it a while. I got a free claim, which I don't really need. So I'm not going to go for it. I'm going to ransom the Ulm. Um person. Um. Peculiar name, indeed. Can we kill you? No. I think we can if I pay for it. I'm not going to... I'm going to. I'm going to. I want to kill you. Oh, good thing I checked. I don't have a court position. Who is the best learning person that I have who is not currently landed and preferably not the patriarch? My son and heir could be my physician. I feel like that's a good thing to go for. He's going to become physician and that's obviously a very good trait. So I should take the opportunity to make him a bit better at this job. Life reaffirmed. I feel like it's a bit dangerous having gone this long without having a court position. I could have been dead by now. That's not enough. I need one more. Giordano. Giordano, rather. That's your real name. Please help me out. <clears throat> Killing this emperor dude. Can I kill you? Can we kill this Aquitine? Yes, we can. I want to go for Aquitine. I'm attacking Aquitine for the Dutch of Aquitine. I think that makes sense. I'm taking their homeland and I'm not feeling guilty about it. Like, why should I? I'm just taking back what belongs to us. She was in jail and he executed his wife. You know what, dude? I don't like you, you pot-smoking dude. You executed my wife. N not, not my wife. My daughter. I'm not married to my daughter. This is not that kind of campaign. He executed my daughter. Which is not particularly nice of him. There are often performers at court. But this time we were promised something special. And I certainly got it. As the troubadour starts yet another stanza, I walk out of the great hall in embarrassment. Each and every song is a dedication to me. Yeah, you're looking a bit puffy. And you married to my son. You are related to, you do have the blood of the prophet. But I don't want to sleep with you, woman. Oops. They're actually very strong. I do think I need some new more help if I want to kill the the Malik. I'm gonna get everyone to help me out if they want to. What we want to? Right, I'm gonna sit you down. I guess I have to start here then. I'm actually losing money now when having these many people raised, which is not particularly good, but I think it's gonna be okay though. I just want to make sure that they cannot kill us in straight battle. That's the reason why. That's my son. He gained another son. Genius, beautiful, and robust. I like that one. Gaius Kaiser. Kaiser. I can't speak. I can't spell. Kaiser. That's how you spell it. Good. We finally have a good grandson. Hopefully, you can give me an even better one further down the line. I would like that. If possible, i create this duchy as well. Come on. There we go. I'm give, granting this to Titus. And I'm granting this one to Sabianus. And then I'm granting everything to Gratian. He is Gratian. He's very gracious. He's so gracious that he became a duke for it. 
That was a really bad pun. That's not particularly much when it comes to money-wise. That's only a Baron, I don't care about it. Good. We are keeping on expanding and it's actually going very quickly now. I like it. Yes, I do. I think that's the forest that's looking a bit weird on the map. I think that's the reason why. He's a Hispania. I want to kill you. We are going to kill him very soon. Eight months away. Then we're going to attack him again. I want to kill the Hakamids as well if I could. But I mainly want to keep on expanding in this direction. And we are getting towards Britannia. It's taking its fair time, but we're going to get there. Eventually. That will not happen. I could kill Luxembourg. Which are actually very strong. Is that the only thing I could go for? Valois. That's one county. Are you serious? Is that the only thing I could go for? Is there anyone with the, with a claim on this duchy thing? Claimants. She's a she's a woman. I can't go for her. This guy. Can can I can I invite you? No, I can't. And you're a child. Well, that's a disappointment. Could I invite someone who belongs to Bavaria? I would like this kingdom, please. Can we find a man? We can't. How old are you? Is your heir? He's a child. He's five years old. If I went for one of these women, which will not happen, which will not happen, and they're all married, so it won't happen. Not this one either. This will probably. Oh, this one could happen. I could just befriend her, and it's gonna happen. Okay, so befriend this woman, and then I'm gonna invite her to my court. Then I'm gonna kill the kingdom of King of Bavaria. Then I'm gonna go press her claim against that guy. Just gain the entire kingdom in one go. Try to speed things up a bit. Oh, that's not something that I wanted. I actually wanted to ransom her. Thank you. I'm gonna do that one either. Someone's trying to kill my concubine. She's too old. Is that why? She actually is. So, thank you for telling me that much. I gotta demand a conversion first. Paula. Which actually makes her love me. I think I'm I think I've forced this woman to be my concubine. But I'm going to dismiss her. <laughs> you don't wanna come back, okay? And I'm gonna replace her with someone else in my jail. Yeah, an Umayyad woman. She's the um one. Um. Um, do you wanna marry me? Wanna be my concubine? Um, yeah. Um, okay. Hilarious wants to marry someone. I'm gonna marry her off to Dimitri. I think he makes the most sense. He's a bit old. He's really good, though. Yeah, Marion Marion. I think. How many people is there of my family now? 210. That's amazing. That's really good. I like that. It's increasing. Bit by bit, the numbers are increasing. And the number of Sweden in Britain is decreasing as well. I think that's a good thing, actually. And and you and Neustria are as actually disappearing out of Ireland bit by bit as well. Oh, you're actually independent. We do have a truce though. Not against this woman. I am going to kill her. I guess that's something that I want to do. And she of course called an holy order. I feel like the Knights Templar are fighting against me all the time. And they're never winning, they're always losing. Oh, you already have a child, and she's a really good one. <coughs> Pardon. That's about it. I only need those people. I want the best commander possible, which is this one. And I'm gonna kill the Knights Templars once and for all. And I'm watching the stars, and I could become cynical. Hmm. It's actually an option to get yet another trait interesting do i want to become cynical 
I'm going to con to con make a new fate. So I think this is actually a good thing. I gained the fourth fate. That's actually awesome. I like it. Avitus. Welcome to the family. I lost my court chaplain, I think. No, that was actually my spine master. Not you, you hate me. I think you killed one of my sisters, but I don't think I'm gonna make this... You tried to murder one of my sisters. You tried to murder someone. At least. I, I think that's the, the issue here. She tried to murder someone. And I have to keep this, otherwise I will get a mental break. So I'm gonna keep it for now. I could take this person down as well, which I'm going to. Thank you for your contribution to the Roman Empire. How much can I guess? They hired the Knights Templars again. Apparently they were able to replenish like two seconds, which I find peculiar. Yes, I do. I feel like there's a lot of people probably pissed off about the fact about my offensive war. 136 minus to opinion. That's not particularly good for us. And apparently I have a bad court chaplain. Which I find interesting. Okay, we kill them. We're gonna siege this place down and we won. And I could make this my friend. I'm gonna relax instead. Right, I'm gonna win this first time. I'm going to disband. I'm gonna have to keep these places for now. Otherwise I will get a mental break. Which I do, do not want. Preferably. That's my rival. He's never getting out. I'm gonna ransom this one person. Can I increase my control? You're trying to already do it. To increase my income. Good to know. Something I was thinking about. What was that thing? What, what was I thinking about? Hmm. I don't know. Why have you been here for... You're my rival. Rival. You're not my rival. I can ransom you. Now stay in there. She's a princess of the Abbasids, and I haven't slept with her yet. She's possessed and melancholic. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Ooh. What was I thinking about? Man, my court chaplain is really bad. Look at you, woman. You're terrible. This guy is so much better. I'm gonna go for this one. No, he's 83 years old. He's gonna die soon. I'm gonna take this one instead. You suck, woman. He's so much better. Everyone is Hellenic, so I don't really care about doing something about the religion issue. I rather would have a nice, a better steward, preferably, but that's not something that I'm capable of finding. Have you become a physician yet? You haven't. You're 35 years old. How old am I? I am 33 years old, but I'm feeling good. So that's a good thing. I am fighting with my weight, though. Still. And I have become cynical in my old age as well. Yes, I have. This is gonna happen in seven years. This is gonna happen in two years. We're actually speeding ahead when it comes to research. This will not happen for another 50 years. That's a long time. I might, I might want to stay off the learning characters for a while now. I used to go for like... Maybe stewardship, potentially. I want some money. We have been struggling with income for a while now. So I think I want to do something about that, preferably. If I could. So potentially something that we can do something about. While attacking some more people. But that's something that I'm going to figure out in due time. I, I do, of course, take in your opinions about what you want to do in the future. We might stay off the learning for a while. As I said, because we are almost finished. Bon appetit. And he's dead. We're almost finished when it comes to this this research. We only need two more, which we will get very soon with this character probably. Then we can get into late medieval age. But that's going to happen in 50 years. We want, might want another character which is not actually learning. 
And then we might want to go for stewardship, I think. As I said, just to gain some money. Which I do think makes sense. I want money, I like money. And I'm gonna grant these three things to the same person. Because I don't want to keep them. Cassio, Julian, Claudian. They're all next to each other so it doesn't particularly matter. And we're actually within the same duchy so you are now a duke. I don't even know if I created that duchy. That was stupid. That was really stupid. I didn't, have, I didn't even have to. But I still wanted to do it because I'm a nice person. You could marry someone. Who? Dimitri. And you, Dominica, you could marry... Who? That's a good question. Marry this Fukun guy. I think that's a good trade to get more of in the family. And I'm also gonna ransom this Abbasid woman. And then I'm gonna take a break. We have finally done some more conquering in France. Some conquering in Spain? or no. We mainly did some things in France. But we are marrying off people and that's a good thing. I like it. But if you have enjoyed this video, make sure to like it. Also make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And write the comment down below if there's something you want to talk about. I do read every single comment, so don't feel shy about it. I do appreciate every single comment that you write. Except in the bad ones. But there's not that many bad ones, eh? It's not a problem. Thanks for watching, guys. See you soon. Take care.